Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Rachel Gray here. I know I look completely different, don't I? But nope, I didn't dye my hair and nope, I uh, I didn't go to the hairdresser. I didn't cut bangs, none of that. <laughs> if you wanna see how I got this look and how I look so different, um, keep watching. I'm basically gonna show you how I did all of this. All it takes is a little bit of time. I would say this look took me in all maybe an hour to complete. And it was a great way to switch up my style. So please keep watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate you. I have already put leave-in oil and some mousse, just a little bit to like start the process and it's already detangled and everything so the next step is for me to get started on this process i have on a shirt that is old <laughs> so you don't have to worry about that um all right so let's start at the beginning i kind of don't pay too much attention about how i part my hair if you want you can do that but because my hair is very long um, I know that I'm not even going to see the sections when I take them apart, so that's okay. So the first thing I'm going to do is, and this is a very, it's kind of like a messy process, I take this much of the hair makeup and I'm just going to get it on my hands like this. And then I'm going to start here and kind of just glaze the hair, okay? So just glaze the hair. And what I found was last time when I did this, the hair makeup, the, the color really shows up after when your hair is drying. So it's going to kind of look dull at first, but then once it dries, it's much more vibrant. So you don't want to, don't worry too much about it being a little bit dark. So you see what I mean by it being kind of a messy process, but, you know, that's life. Okay. So, separate. And the thing is, you want your hair to be damp, and you also want it to be very smooth, because that is how... The curls come out smooth in the end and it doesn't just look like oh I did another wash and go and you want it to be damp because that is going to help with its setting as well so I'm just glazing the hair with the hair makeup making sure it's glazed well and make sure it's evenly distributed as well that's something I also found that I that I did wrong last time that I wanted to improve on is kind of making sure that it's evenly coated. I'm going to wrap the hair around the roller until I get to my head. And then I'm going to fasten it. And this is the tricky part, the fastening has always been the tricky part for me. Because it's like, is it on there? If this happens, you can just push it down a little bit. There we go.
always so scared because I never know, like, you know, you have this thought in your mind, but oh my gosh, look at the curl. It's set perfectly. I am so excited about this. You guys, this is like beautiful. Oh, hello. You guys see that, right? Isn't that pretty? Like, wow. Wow. I think this is better than the last time I did it. And the, um, the color makes it look even better. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> okay, you guys. As you can see, these are some beautiful bouncy curls, which I will separate. I'm going to do my makeup. I'm going to do my outfit. <laughs> and I will see you guys soon after I basically unravel these curls and separate them. And you will see the final product. I will see you then. Hi, guys. Okay, so I basically fluffed out my hair and did a lot of teasing. <laughs> And I came up with this. So obviously I didn't cut bangs. What I did was I kind of flipped my hair and I pinned some of the side pieces onto my the top of my head and then I flipped my hair over. If you want to see a detailed tutorial about how I do that, then sure, I will do that for you. Just put it down in the description in the comments sorry guys um but i love this what do you guys think do you love it i think this is perfect for new year's um and whatever i just want to switch up my look somewhat you know this is perfect and the great thing about this is i found in my previous review on the gold curlsmith product that it kind of transferred right but i slept last night uh, in my rollers and my pillow does not have any transfer so I'm hoping that the copper doesn't transfer like the gold does and honestly even if it does I really don't have that much of a problem with it because this looks spectacular and it's just a beautiful look that I wouldn't be able to get otherwise so that's my thoughts. That's my opinion. I am very impressed. As as I said before with this product, I really like it and I would encourage you to try it out because <sighs> that's us. Curly girls, we can switch up our looks like this. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe. I appreciate you watching so much. Bye guys. Have a wonderful, happy, happy new year.